Two babies in Tobago have tested positive for COVID-19. Head of Pediatric Emergency Department at the Eric Williams Medical Sciences Complex, Dr. Joanne Paul, confirmed the news at Wednesday's Ministry of Health press conference. Dr. Paul said the babies are doing well and present very mild symptoms. Kimberly D'Souza reports. In fact, the, the one you mentioned in Tobago, in fact, we have two in Tobago, one a five-month-old and a six-month-old who have confirmed being positive for COVID. And Head of Pediatrics in the Emergency Department of the Eric Williams Medical Sciences Complex, Dr. Joanne Paul, confirmed the news at Wednesday's Ministry of Health press conference. While she said the babies are doing well, she encouraged parents to be on the lookout for symptoms of Miss C, which is the multi-inflammatory syndrome in children. So we might see things like they might present with red eyes, red lips and tongue called strawberry tongue. They'll have a rash all over them and the rash could be anything aside from the chicken pox rash. Next slide. Also, we have this thing called COVID tours. The same clot formation might be in the tours. So you might have it where the vessels there get some clots and you have it where you see little spots in the tours and the fingers. Dr. Paul said Missy is a multi-systems disease which affects the lungs, heart and brain in children. While some children may develop Miss C as a result of COVID-19, some may not be positive for the virus, but can still develop the disease. But remember, with Miss C, it's in the inflammatory aspect, and therefore it's after, so they may not be positive with COVID. So we have had a few of them who have been negative with COVID, but serology has been positive. So the antibodies have been there, the tests have been done and they've been showing that they have shown signs of Miss C. She said in total, 20 cases of Miss C have been reported, but there have been no fatalities. I think in total, they've come from various places. We've had one from Tobago and they've all gone to Mount Hope, one from the Sunny Grandi area, but the majority of them have been on the east-west corridor and the central area and less so in South Dope. In terms of the demographics, they have been mainly mixed population, um, some Afro Trinidadians and some um, mostly mixed and um, a few Indo Trinidadian, but mainly mixed and Afro. Which goes While Trinidad and Tobago has more cases of Messi than other Caribbean islands, Dr. Paul believes it is as a result of our mixed population. Kimberly D'Souza, TTT News.